Hello and welcome to Solve for today's video and today's puzzle which is not a puzzle for you but for your friends. So how does this work? Well you're gonna need a ring that you can borrow and a piece of string that you're going to tie into a loop. You can use shoelaces, no problem. So the idea is to ask a spectator to hold their thumb, uh, their thumbs like this. You put the ring on the string and and the string on the thumbs with the ring in the middle and you're gonna tell the spectator that you're going to remove the ring without uh, removing the string from the thumb which is uh, what you're going to actually do and then you're going to ask the spectator to do the same which is going to prove very difficult okay for this I'm gonna use a loop of string and a ring. I put the ring in the loop, put the thumb like this. Super. Okay, one here, one there. Now I'm going to remove the, uh, the ring without removing the string in two moves. The first move is like this. And the second move is like that. Okay? Now if I hold the ring, let go here. Okay, now you try. That's pretty. Nice pattern. <coughs> That's right. <laughs> the trick to succeed this is to have all the spectators in front of you. When you do the trick, and then when you're going to try to do the trick themselves, they will have to reverse everything like in a mirror, but not exactly because it's right, left, and dead, and that's, gonna, that's going to prove much, much too intricate. So if you keep your spectators in front of you, maybe a little bit on the side, you'll be okay. So you have your ring, you have your string, and what you're going to do, of course, you make a loop with the string, with a very bad ugly knot here, it doesn't matter, and then you just thread the ring in the on the string, and you left with this. Then on the thumbs of the spectator, like this. What you want to have is the not on your right because you don't want the knot to be entangled with what you're going to do and everything is going to be done on the left so what you're going to do is that you're going to take the ring put it a little bit on the right and then your left hand is going to pinch the top strand like this and your right hand is going to pinch the bottom strand like this I'm gonna put it away and then you pull them towards you. So if you want to remember, it's very easy 
think about something like thumb up. The, the side of the thumb you're going to work with, you can take the top strand and, the, and then the bottom strand with the other hand. So with your left hand you pinch the top, with your right hand you pinch the bottom and you pull everything towards you and make uh, one triangle here. Raise your hand a little bit, okay. One triangle here. And with your right hand you're going to hook this one clockwise on the thumb. Then you're going to take the strand, the top strand, away the other side of the ring. And you're going to put it on the, the other thumb again clockwise. And basically you're done. Because now you're left with something you're hooking, you're, you're still holding this with your, with your left hand and you just grab the ring, let go with your left hand and then the ring goes away easily. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed this trick and you're going to do it on a lot of people and that they're going to enjoy it too. Before that, try to get it a little bit smooth. You can try on a chair, on lots of anything that has two nails or so whatever. Get it smooth, once you're done with it, you're gonna see it's, uh, it's a good trick to do to your friends. I hope you enjoyed it and uh, see you next time for next video, bye bye!